Hello, today we are assembling the DDP-125 pan kit. For this project you will need a Phillips head screwdriver as well as a 764 hex head driver. First you'll take the 1 quarter inch precision flanged ball bearing and press it into the ABS plate. The ABS plate has a textured side and a smooth side. The textured side is the side that we will be pressing the ball bearing into. This is a pretty tight fit so you might need a hammer in order to tap that in all the way. Next grab the 440 by 3 8 inch flat head machine screws and the 3 quarter inch round aluminum standoffs. The ABS plate has two sets of holes use the set of holes that are countersunk to attach the aluminum standoffs to the smooth side of the ABS plate. Once you've attached the four aluminum standoffs grab the servo shaft horn and your servo. For this video we are using the HS 425 BB servo. Slide the shaft horn onto the output shaft of your servo and then fit the ABS plate over the top. Do take care not to knock the ball bearing out of place while you're doing this. Next you need the 1 quarter inch aluminum clamping hub and the 632 by 3 8 inch socket head screw. Put those together using your hex head driver. Make sure to leave it loose enough that it can be slid over the shaft horn. Once you have those together, do attach that to the shaft horn and tighten it up. You now have a choice between the 2.6 by 30 millimeter machine servo screw or the coarse servo screw. The machine screw is for metal geared servos, whereas the coarse screw is for servos with nylon or carbonite gears. When tightening this screw onto the shaft horn, be sure to hold on to the clamping hub rather than the servo itself. This will allow you to tighten the screw without risking stripping any of the gears. Finally, use the 440 by 1 quarter inch truss head screws to attach the servo to the back of the aluminum standoffs. That is the DDP-125 pan kit. If you have any questions about this video or if there are any videos you'd like to see us do, leave a comment. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.